Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. Today I will show you this engine that was sent to me by the friends at GearBest.com. It is an external combustion engine of the flame leaker type. This is what comes in the box, the engine itself, a spirit lamp or burner, this is for uh, storing the alcohol, three X keys, small piece of tubing, and a manual and parts list. Except for the wood base and the piston, the engine is all made of metal, aluminum and bronze. And one thing I like is that everything, every part is joined with screws. So you can disassemble the engine completely in order to clean it or for adjustment. Also a good thing is that the axis has counterweights and this permits a smooth running of the motor. Here is the piston. I am not completely sure, but it seems to be made of graphite. Ok, let's see the engine in action. Let's see how the engine works. These engines are also known as vacuum engines because the power stroke of the piston is thanks to a vacuum in the cylinder. When the flywheel rotates we have two movements. One is the piston that moves inside the cylinder because it is coupled with the flywheel. And also we have this mechanism that moves this curtain up and down. As you can see, there is a hole here that communicates with the interior of the cylinder. When the flywheel is in this position, the piston is to the right and the curtain is closed. Now, the flywheel rotates, the piston starts to move to the left and the curtain opens. Now in this position the piston is completely to the left and the heat of the flame enters the cylinder. The flywheel continues its movement, the curtain closes and now the cylinder is completely to the right. The air, the hot air is inside the cylinder and now it cools 
because the heat dissipates through the walls of the cylinder. When the air cools down, it creates a vacuum inside the cylinder that sucks the piston and makes it move to the left, making the flywheel rotate. And now the curtain opens again, the hot air enters the cylinder and the cycle repeats. This type of external combustion engine has really no practical use because of their low efficiency, which is around 5%. However, they are great for educational purposes and is great fun to see them working. If you want to buy this engine, in the description of this video I give you the link to the GearBest page. This is all for today. I hope you have enjoyed this engine, thanks for your visit and see you in the next video.